Hey everybody, Bud Cole here, president of Asia Pacific for Fender Music Corporation. Want to say hi to everybody here in Japan and to everybody all around the world. Couldn't be more excited to open up the Fender flagship Tokyo, Fender's first flagship right here in one of the greatest cities in the world, Tokyo, Japan. So looking forward to answering some questions today and really, really excited about this amazing experience for guitar players of every experience and level to come here to Tokyo and see our store. Well, I'm the president of Fender Music Corporation here across Asia Pacific, which means I lead the strategy, uh, I lead our team, I lead all our initiatives across uh, the entire region. The funny thing about it is this, is that right out of college in 1991 when I went to Arizona State University, my very first job interview was for a PR assistant with Fender Music Corporation. And guess what? I didn't get it. So it was really cool to come back in 2014 and to be asked by uh, Fender Music Corporation to come and lead their organization in the next phase of development in this part of the world. Well, the wonderful thing about this job is that we get to see music and players all the time. And especially being out here in Asia Pacific, we've got amazing players at every stage, right here in Japan, in Korea, in China, in the Philippines, in Thailand, all throughout Southeast Asia, down to Australia and New Zealand and across the entire region. So for me, my experiences happen every day, every hour when I see people playing our instruments. I would have to say if I had to pick out an experience I've had recently, um, there's a new artist called the Chili Beans, which is part of the Fender Next program. Um, they're a Japanese band. I saw them play the other night. Um, their energy, their songwriting, their musicality, their capabilities, and just the energy they had on stage um, it's been a while since I've been that blown away by a really new and cool band and uh, it's just really exciting to see. Well, Made in Japan guitars, I gotta say I'm a little bit biased. My very first guitar, uh, in, I bought this in 1988 um, in the U.S. This is a Made in Japan uh, 1969 reissue Thinline Telecaster. It's the only guitar I ever played live in a studio touring when I was in my 20s and it's been with me and has never left my side since. I love this guitar. The sound, the tonality, the way it looks and it can really take a beating. It's just an amazing, amazing guitar. Um, the Made in Japan guitars for me, um, I mean they are part of the big family of Fender guitars and have a really rich history uh, here in Japan. I would say they've got some unique um, tonality which makes them a little bit different, but certainly in the spectrum of the Fender tone and the Fender sound. Uh, they've got some unique finishes. Their necks are uh, a little bit different for, for people that want that specific neck and that playability from that neck. And I just think over the years, um, we've really spent a lot of time working on and designing and really pushing the limits of Made in Japan guitars with traditional series, modern series, hybrid series. Well, first of all, let's start at the top. Why Tokyo and why Japan? Um, throughout the world, one of the most exciting, interesting, and sophisticated retail environments is right here in Tokyo, Japan. And that combined with some of the most educated, and sophisticated, and brand savvy consumers right here in Japan make it a perfect location to open up Fender's first flagship store. Not to mention the fact that projections say that there's over 30 million people that will be visiting Japan over the next year from all around the world. So for me, someone who's lived in Japan for over 20 years, I can't think of a better place for Fender to open up its first flagship store in the world. So in line with our mission to support players wherever they are in their musical journey, our Fender flagship Tokyo will do just that. When a new player walks into our store, the first thing they're gonna see when they walk in on the first floor, it's all about the latest and greatest and new products from Fender. And you know, Fender's known for innovative, interesting instruments, and so they're gonna see a lot of that 
We're also going to see very, very compelling marketing and visuals which explain this product and the differences. So everything that you see in the media and social media, new products, you're going to see that on the first floor and you're going to know what Fender stands for. We also have a great connection with our artists, so you're always going to see the newest and the coolest, latest artist model on the first floor, which I know a lot of beginners are inspired to play from their artists. So we really have a great relationship with our artists and we really want to make sure that people are inspired right when they walk through the door uh, and, and, and feel a sense of connection with their artists. Also on the first floor, for those people who are just getting into playing or don't even play yet, even if you decide not to buy a guitar, there's still amazing fashion and really cool swag that you can wear from our brand F is for Fender and a lot of destination product that we've got for Fender Flagship Tokyo on the first floor. The next area I'd go if you were a beginner is I would take a, a walk down to B1. B1 is Fender's first acoustic only offering. In the basement we've got our Fender's first uh, acoustic offering which is all of our acoustic uh, guitars along with our acoustasonic guitars, our ukulele. We've got this very, very warm and inviting room, which is really important because nine out of 10 people that pick up the guitar the first time, usually it's the acoustic guitar that they pick up to start with. So we wanna be very, very open and comforting to our consumers that come in, our new beginners, to come on down, try out acoustic guitars, try out electric guitars. But that basement floor with the acoustic guitars it's going to be very, very nice and really, really just going to be surrounded by acoustic guitars. And it's the first uh, Fender acoustic guitar room in the entire world. And we're really excited about that. At the same time, to make it even more comfortable, we've got the Fender's first Fender Cafe, which is powered by Verve Coffee out of Santa Cruz, California. And so you can sit down, have a coffee, think about your guitars, whether it's acoustic, electric, signature guitar, this type of guitar, which series you want, and just spend a lot of time on that basement floor because it's going to be beautiful and it's going to be all about acoustic guitars. Well, at the core, everybody at Fender believes that music makes a difference in the world. And 77 years of history at Fender, tip of the spear, number one electric guitar, bass, and amp brand in the world. Our products are on every stage, in every nightclub, in every studio, and in millions and millions of homes and households and apartments all across the world where people are playing and practicing and writing and creating music. And so for many of those consumers, uh, this is just the next step. They want a direct connection with the Fender brand. Um, and the Fender flagship store Tokyo gives them that first connection uh, directly with our brand to come and experience and be inspired by all that Fender has been and all that it can be uh, for musicians all around the world. Leo Fender said many times, artists are angels and it's our job at Fender to give them the wings to fly. The Fender flagship Tokyo is a tribute to all the artists that are playing writing and inspiring people with their music over the last 77 years. It's also a tribute to all the new aspiring players that are picking up the guitar for the first time or just learning guitar to advance their craft and to get better playing music and to come and learn all about Fender and our flagship store and to everybody in between that knows that music makes a difference, that loves to play guitar, that loves to play bass, loves to write music and play music and, and um, we couldn't be more excited about the Fender flagship store here in Tokyo. And we couldn't be more excited about any and all of you coming out to visit us in this wonderful city right here in Japan. Thank you very much. Domo arigato gozaimasu.